Virgo. Welcome back to the channel. Let's take a look at your love energetics, Virgo. Let's see what you have coming in in regards to love and romance. What spirit wants you to know? What can we relate to the card of Manti in regards to the matters of the heart for you? So allow me to find the cards and we'll get to the channeling. Messages for Virgo today, Spirit. What does Virgo need to know in regards to love, romance, incoming love and romance messages? We got a jumper. Ace of Wands, New Beginnings. Several jumpers. Two of Cups. Relationships. Mm -hmm. Four of Cups. Okay. It will be distractions, right? An incoming love offer attempting to come towards you. This person could be very picky. Right? Oh, that's not the two of cups. That's the ten of cups. So this person has been holding off for you. It, they could possibly be very picky. Like myself, I say I can't really have sex with just any random person. One night stand, right? Although there's always women in my face. Ten of cups, right? So this person could be very attractive or very... Mm, they're very creative or something like that, or they're very attractive, basically, right? Um, and then here with completion, there's a lot of people here that see this person as wish fulfillment, but they are picky. They're very selective here. You know how the Four of Wands appears on an original right away tarot? This person may even see you as a distraction. <laughs> the Page of Wands, yeah, curiosity. Childlike wonder, curiosity is, right? Invention. But this could also be immature sexual advances as well. The devil, yeah. The devil's been showing up a lot in a reading today. Well, it's Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs> so, Virgo, yeah. Uh, it's earth sign energy, so you may be familiar with it, right? Being very hardworking or being very detail-oriented, right? The devil is a new contract, right? It's also indicative of an earthbound celebrity. Again, this person is well loved here for their <clears throat> creativity or uh, maybe their celebrity here. It could be like clout chasing vibes here. A lot of people probably want to get with this person because of what they do or who they are or what they have. However, it resonates. Let's take a look at the energies at the bottom of the deck. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, this person wants to come towards you and build some sort of a new friendship. They're prospecting you here in Five of Cups to change up an emotion. So you're not like everyone else here to this person. In fact, you turn this person on, right? You could even be some sort of a muse for this person. Um, I'm not quite getting a conquest, but yeah, they definitely want to sleep with you. They want to bed you. It could even be some sort of a creative project because the devil is a hard worker here and the Ace of Wands is a new beginning when it comes to creativity, right? Passionate endeavors and what have you, like a spark of inspiration. So you guys may be able to work on some sort of a new project together. Mm -hmm. But they definitely see love with you here, Ten of Cups, starting a, a love journey. They possibly want a large family with you if we were to look down the line. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What am I getting? I can't even remember that song. It's a nursery song, but I'm too old to remember it, right? The, the, it sucks to get old. Something with the dun da da go one by one, hurrah, hurrah. But I don't remember what the lyrics are. <laughs> so this is where you come in for this person to inspire them to um, into new uh, create creativity, into new. They may like younger people here. Okay. So this person may be older than you. Again, appearing as some sort of a CEO, a leader, maybe a supervisor an entrepreneur they may even be a content creator but that is what i have for you here today what is that song is it the ants go marching one by one i, I don't know i don't know. catch you guys on the next one happy halloween peace